Good morning. Time for some coffee. So there you have it. That's the home assistant face detection with an echo dot announcing I guess an automation it says good morning um would you want some coffee it says good morning Andrew would you want some coffee so pretty much it's a process where it's have it set up to trigger once a day so it doesn't repeat itself as if it's detect your face over and over again so it basically detects your face go through the automation and it's once per day it doesn't repeat it over and over again and this process, I use a Weiss cam, which is a cheap camera, like $40. And then simple Echo Dot. Uh, my goal is to have this at, on the doorbell. I'm gonna get a video doorbell and have it on the doorbell. So it detects family members' faces when they walk up to the door. It will make a, and start an automation where it will announce it via the Echo Dots in the house. Um, says the person's name who's at the door and then we'll be able to go see. And I'm gonna have it pop up on the phone as a video stream, like, hey, this person's at the door. Um, and just tap and hold the notification and the video stream would start and I could see who's at the door before I even get up and go there or so forth. And then also I'm gonna set up object detection. So in case someone who's not a family that's at the door, it'll be say, hey, a person is at the door and so forth. So to set this up, I have a home assistant um, running as a VM and I have Facebox running as a VM. And so the first thing I did, obviously you set up home assistant and then I install Alexa media player. You got to install hacks. I'll have all the links below for everything that you need to get done. Um, have hacks install um, Alexa media player and then have Facebook, Facebook set up inside of Docker um, to be able to communicate with home assistants. So you need all of those stuff set up and then you, you know what I'm saying, you put it all together. So I've, I, will, I will have all the details down in the description where you can download the files, watch the, um, the guides and and how to set it all up. And the process is, is pretty simple. I'll show you some of my, uh, some of the stuff I have set up and how I did it. And then you could follow and, or you can follow the instructions that I provided below, but however you wanna do it, it's not a very difficult process and it's very nifty. I will have it set up in the future to uh, alert me on news if I'm down here at two or three o'clock. I can get an alert on news, like, hey, here's your news briefing for today. And I'll also set up actionable notifications to make sure, um, like for example, like, hey, can we preheat your car for you? You're about to leave, um, do you want us to preheat your car? And I'm like, yes, Alexa, and so, there's a lot of futuristic stuff I could be able to start doing with it. So I'm definitely gonna start um, using it more and have it better utilized, I would say.